Before we jump into this week's video, I wanted to point you to flagfootballwithcoachd.com. Just a quick reminder, I've got all of these resources for you. Look, I don't want to be super salesy with this stuff. You know, I'm just a, a dad who, you know, almost a decade ago was kind of thrown into this just like all of us. Um, but some popular things that most coaches are looking for are playbooks. Uh, this by far is the most popular. It basically puts all of my plays practice schedules, drills, templates uh, in one place. That one's very popular. Also, the boot camp includes the complete coach package, um, but it also has 30 exclusive videos uh, of me out on the field teaching you everything that you need to know. And then just recently, I, uh, I put together a play builder basically like a playmaker or play designer or anything else that you've ever used. Uh, you can import all of my plays or you can create your plays from scratch. Super simple to use. Check it out and uh, hopefully it gives you everything that you need to be a complete coach. And then of course, make sure that you're subscribing so you never miss a video. You know, I started with uh, my backyard, but we've got offense, defense, drills, how to coach new players, those are my kids, um, tutorials and so much more. We're over 15,000 now, so would love to have you part of the community. All right, let's jump into this week's video. Hi everyone, this is Coach D, Coach Sammy, and Noah, and today we're gonna do our route role play. This is going to have a defense formation out there on the field, and then we're going to teach the wide receivers how to run clean, accurate routes with defense out there you know it's very easy to kind of say okay let's just run this route or that route but then they get in the game and if something's in their way which way do they go and they start adjusting or changing the route we want to stop that right here so here's what we've done we've put a defense out on the field so we have what's called the husker that means we've got three cornerbacks in the middle here we've got a safety up top and then we have a linebacker here. Our line of scrimmage will be about right here. And then we have a wide receiver cone about right over here. And what's gonna happen is we're gonna do a few routes with your defense out here. So the first thing you wanna do is have your defense stand out here in their formation, okay? So I'm gonna have five players out here, or if you're six V six, seven V seven, you get it. And then I'm going to have my wide receiver stand on that cone and then run, let's say a post. And then how are they going to adjust when they see defenders in these spots? Now the defenders at, at, at the base level can just stay put, right? And then we'll, over time, Sammy actually had this idea. Maybe you can create a nice little circle so maybe they can move just a little bit so it distracts them. And then you can actually turn it into a live um, simulation, okay? But here's what's gonna happen. I'm gonna go out on this cone, be a cornerback. Sammy's gonna be here, and Noah's gonna run a post. Let's see how it works. So, base level, we're just gonna stand here as defenders, right? And you don't need that because you're a wide receiver going out for a pass. All right. Ready, go. Okay, come on back. You can have a nice line there and they're going to then learn how to do that, okay? Now the first time we ran this, Noah, what happened? I went on stage. Yeah, because he saw Sammy standing here, he was like, oh, I'm just gonna cut and I'm gonna go back the other way. And then Sammy said, well, I'm a quarterback and what does that do? Then if they're supposed to run a, uh, a post, what happens? So it's either the ball I've already thrown, so I'm expecting them there and it's already open. Yeah. Or it, I lose them and kind of don't know where to throw while being rushed. Right. So again, what this is doing is it's teaching your players to run the routes that are in the play. All right. So now let's run a, let's say a quick slant right across. Sammy, maybe you go over there. Now again, you're gonna have all your players in their positions, right? So maybe I'm here. Again, you're gonna have somebody here, but just for the video, let's say I'm right here. Quick slant, ready, go. Okay. 
Okay, so he's deciding to go right in between those two defenders. So this is also helping your quarterback. All right. Now should we change it up a little bit and maybe allow us to move a little bit, you think? Probably. Okay, let's do the post again. Now you can do this for all of your routes that are on your playbook. You can switch this up, but now I have, let's say, a nice little one foot or one yard little d diameter here. I can move around to block him. You're going to do a post. Ready, go. Okay, and again, all you're trying to do is teach that wide receiver to run the accurate route no matter what the distraction is. Let's do the other one. Yep, quick slant. Now I'm going to be in this position. <clears throat> Ready, go. Right? And check this out. Here, go to that position again and go to your quick slant. Let me show you. Ready, go. He's actually going to be open. Come here real quick. You stand here. This also teaches them about the play. You know, if you were to run, let's say, in front or even behind, he's going to be open right here. So no matter, everybody come up. No matter what is happening out here, you start also to realize where are they going to be open. So as he runs from here, not open, not open, boom, open right here. Because now he's running full speed, full speed across right here. And this is where the ball should be thrown. So it's also identifying for your quarterbacks where on the route they're going to be open. You want to do any more? Oh, sure. Okay, let's do, let's do an out pattern. No, let's do an in pattern. Let's see if you got that. Ready, go. Okay, so he's cutting in. Do it again. Now with this person. Ready, go. Okay, look, an, an out pattern. This is where you coach in the moment. All right, Noah, let me see that one again. I'm just going to be a coach here. Do it half speed and in pattern. Ready, go. Yeah. Okay, so we want him in front of this line. So I want you to a crisp line right across here. Okay, so you're in front of the offense, or right in front of this line right here, this defense. And this guy doesn't know where you're going to be, and you are now open right here. Because I'm coming back here, right? So let's try that one more time. Crisp line right in front, right? This is how you get your route super clean, super crisp. Ready, go. Right, and he's right there. So those are those are moments to coach in the moment. Guys, what does coach in the moment mean? Give them corrections while they're going here playing. Is that like a pain for you no. as, a, as a player? No. You kind of like it or? It's okay. <laughs> it's tough. I'm your dad, so it's kind of like, Dad, come on, man. <laughs> All right. But this gives you the opportunity to have really clean routes. It's important when you're running your plays that the quarterback, right, is able to see, right? Yeah. She's told me this a hundred times. Why is it important for, for wide receivers, running backs to run the right routes? Because there's 10 players on the field most of the time, and every once in a while, it's hard to distinguish who's on your team. Okay. Also, uh, you don't know where, you know where everyone should be right. and who you're supposed to hit. They should be where they're supposed to be. Yes, if they're running the correct route, then she can predict, okay, well, that's covered, but they're running the correct route. If everybody's just kind of figuring it out and going sloppy, then everybody's mashed together, mm -hmm. and that creates a lot of interceptions. So, Noah, in order for us to have a really nice reception for in you. In order for you to get those touchdowns that you like to have, you gotta run those crisp routes. Now he's really good at the fly. Last one, let's do a fly. <clears throat> now, let's go full on. Ready, go. Nice. Now, because
because we're in a zone defense, right? I would stick with him for my zone and then Sammy would move over into that as well. So we showed a little bit of defense, showed a little bit of offense. So we just learned how to run clean routes so that we can score more touchdowns and win more games. Noah, Sammy, this is Coach D. If you like what you see, go ahead and like, subscribe, Comment. Comment. Got to comment. I mean, we will. We will respond. Noah will respond personally to any of your comments. All right. What else? Crush the bell. What does the bell do? Smash the bell. Oh, smash the bell. See, man, teaching me what is happening. All right. If you need playbooks, if you're trying to figure out what should my plays actually look like, go to Flag Football with Coach D. We've got everything you need to crush it as a complete coach. We'll see you in the next video. Take care.